This gentleman is Mr. Small. We're having some trouble getting him to verbalize. Is that correct, Mr. Small? He can speak, but he just won't. Now, Mr. Small cannot afford to go to another doctor. All my life, I have worked with people who have no place else to go. I'm sorry to seem unreasonable, but if you want me, you'll have to wait for me. I expect you'd better finish with him later, Mildred. Dr. Strauss, you are a money raiser. Go and raise money. I am a doctor. Leave me to my work. Nurse, take him to the ward. He stays with me. Now, ma'am, you are flouting my authority. Y'all take this poor unfortunate away, you know? Not in my office, you don't. That's an order. No. Oh, Mr. Small! Mr. Small! Oh! Release that man. No one belongs to one of those. If you please. Next time, are you all right? Hmm. Who let this happen? Who's in charge here? Mr. Small, I'm so sorry. Can you forgive me? You don't let her off so lightly. She decent to you? You like her? She didn't do this to you, then. Who did? You did. Oh, I guess you're really Sherlock Holmes after all. <laughs> you don't at all. You think I'm mad. You and us are all alike. Thinks you're mad too, as well, eh? Why? Because you won't talk? Not typical. Why is it analysts can't ever analyze? Don't tell me you've deduced what's wrong with Mr. Small. Not yet. I can do if you like. Will you nod when I'm right? Now, I should an obviously proper gentleman hmm? refuse to talk because he hasn't been introduced. <laughs> we don't know who you are, but once we do know, then you'll talk. Now, where does the logic think he can talk, but he won't? The silence is the clue there. No coaching, please. I've worked by pure deduction. Uh, who was silent? Who had everything but sound? Uh, the mutes of history? No, they couldn't talk. He can. A monk with vows of silence. No, no. No sound. No sound. Why, the early movie. Well, the man's a silent film star. Which one? The most unlikely one. It's only logical. That means he's brave, huh? Man of action. Stern. Aloof. Yet passionate. My God. That's Rudolf Valentino. Sherlock Holmes. Oh, no, sir. I've read your books. I'm really quite a fan of yours. I'll be damned. Tell him how much you liked him in the chic. This is ridiculous. You didn't like me. Oh, no, no, you were very good. I wish we had you on the staff here. You could use me. Well, I must be off. My best to Vilma Vecchi. Oh, uh, couldn't we just uh, sit down and talk? Uh, we could discuss your work. I'm very sorry. I'm a terribly busy man. I don't have time to be examined. Uh, are you working on a case? Better save your strength for Mr. Small. The chances are he isn't really Valentino. Well, I like that. No offense. I have daily office hours. If you feel the need of a consultation, please feel free to call for an appointment. 